well-known passes just off the N7 route between Citrustal and Clan William and offers a tarred road in good condition that rises up an attractive cliff with mainly easy curves and fairly comfortable gradients. It's a fairly short pass at 3.2 kilometers and rises 165 meters in altitude, producing an average gradient of 1 in 19. The road is suitable for all vehicles. The pass is easy to find. Travel northwards from Citrustal on the N7 for 19 kilometers, then turn left to Marcus Kral. The road is tarred and in good condition, but cyclists should note that it has no safety shoulders. The road makes a large S-curve, initially heading into the southwest, as it rises slowly through orange orchards and an attractive farming area. The first two farms, left and right respectively, are Eitzig and Arbeitsgenot. As the road turns into the west, the farm Markuskral makes an appearance on the left. There is also a popular 4x4 route on this farm. A deep ravine on the right plays host to a small river. This is the Dinarskloof and the river is crossed via a small bridge. The heading remains in the northwest, but the gradient increases a lot as the hill climb begins. The worst section is right after the river and it lasts for about one kilometer, where after the gradient eases off a bit. Once up the first hill, the road passes the Nivapos farm on the right and heads for the next farm, which is Harvachskloof. This is about halfway along the pass and soon the road kinks over the crossing of the Grootkloofrevier. To your right are two large farm dams with cobalt blue water, which are fed by the same stream and ahead lies the huge bulk of the Skimmelberg mountain with an altitude of 1201 meters. A short while later, the road descends down to a T-junction where you have the option of turning left to Citrustal or you could take the right-hand road to Clan William.